Hello kids, I heard you're curious about why we have feelings and emotions. Get ready for an enlightening journey as we dive into the fascinating world of our emotions. Hi, teacher. Sometimes I feel happy, sad, or angry, and I wonder why we have these feelings. Can you help me understand? Of course, Bella. Our feelings and emotions are a natural and important part of being human. They help us understand and navigate the world around us. Just like our body tells us when we're hungry or tired, our emotions communicate how we're feeling inside. So, our emotions are like signals to help us understand ourselves better? Exactly. Emotions are like messengers that provide us with valuable information. For example, when we feel happy, it usually means something good has happened, like achieving a goal or spending time with loved ones. On the other hand, Feeling sad or upset can be a signal that something isn't going well or that we need support. I got it. Our emotions tell us what's happening inside us and around us. I'm proud of you. Our emotions also help us connect with others. When we see someone crying, we understand that they're sad and may need comfort. When we see someone smiling, we know they're happy and might want to share in their joy. It's amazing how our emotions help us relate to others. But sometimes, our emotions can feel overwhelming. What should we do then? Great point. While emotions are essential, it's also important to learn how to manage and control them. Just like driving a car, we want to be in control and steer our emotions in a positive direction. How do we control our emotions, teacher? Well, there are a few things we can use. One helpful technique is taking deep breaths. When we feel overwhelmed, we can take slow, deep breaths to calm ourselves down. We can also try talking to someone we trust, like a family member or friend, who can provide support and help us understand our feelings. That sounds helpful. Are there any other ways to manage our emotions? Absolutely. Engaging in activities we enjoy, like drawing, writing, or playing sports, can help us release and express our emotions in a healthy way. Sometimes, taking a break and spending time in nature can also be calming and soothing. I'll remember that, teacher. It's important to find positive ways to express and control our emotions. Precisely. Remember, our emotions are like colorful paint on a canvas, and it's up to us to create a beautiful picture. By understanding and managing our emotions, we can navigate life with more confidence and make better decisions. Teacher, learning about our emotions was interesting. I'll practice controlling them and expressing them in positive ways. You're most welcome, my thoughtful learner. Emotions are a gift that helps us experience the richness of life. Remember, it's okay to feel different emotions, but it's important to handle them with kindness and understanding, both for ourselves and for others.